Today we're going to do adding and subtracting with Play-Doh. So I will do two adding problems and then two subtracting problems to get you started. And then with your Play-Doh, you can do some more. So first I need to take my Play-Doh and make it into different pieces. So I think for this, we'll, five pieces will be good. So just break it apart one time, two times, three times and four times and that will leave you with five pieces one two three four five so i'm just going to make them into little balls now for adding adding is making more so i'm actually going to hide some of the balls and i'll start out with three here when you add, there's going to be more. So more are going to come. It will be bigger. So I have one, two, three to start off with, or you could subitize and see three. And then two new balls roll in to make more. So we have three, we would say plus two. I can actually draw. I think it should wipe off my table here. Plus three plus two. And when we put them all together, all together, there's more than three, right? There's even more than two. All together, there's one, two, three, four, five. So three plus two equals five. Three plus two equals five. All right, let's try a smaller one. I'm going to do two plus one. Now, if, you, if you're um, used to subitizing, you might even know the answer already without counting them. But remember, we started off with two, and now we have more. Now we have three. 2, 1, 2, plus 1 more. So I'm going to count them all. 1, 2, 3. 3 is the answer. 2 plus 1 equals 3. And then you could write it. I'm going to write it. No, I'm going to move it so you can see. There's my 3. If I were to write it on the, t write it out, I would write 2 plus, make sure you can see my writing here, 1 equals 3. So now you can do more on your own. Let me get my eraser. Oh, he's right here. I'm writing on my table because I know that I can erase it off. It's a dry erase marker, by the way. All right, so when, with minus now, minus we're going to end up with less. So I have a lot. I have all five out right now. And with minus, we're going to take away some. I'm going to put them away out of, the, out of the picture. They're gone. So they'll be less. So it would look like this. I have three. No, I have five. <laughs> and I would take away, let's say two. So sometimes you'll see it written out ahead of time. And we take away how many? Let's take away two. So one, two, I'm gonna take them away. Five, take away two equals how many are left? One, two, three. Three, that's subtraction. There used to be five, a lot. Two went away, and now there's less. If the answer's smaller, it's three. Let's do one more. All right, we have, let's start with three this time. So let's start with four. So I have four. I'll write that down. Just 
start with, there are four. And I'm going to take away, let's take away two this time again. And what does that equal? Remember the answer has to be less. So I have four. I'm going to take away one, two. And they're going to go over here on the other side of all my toys. And how many are left? Two. Four, take away two, it's two. And that's subtraction.